giga, kilo and mega quantities. We can use them everywhere, in biology, in computer science, and I'm always confusing with the giga and the mega. How many zeros in them? But now it's so easy to remember. Let me share with you. I guess everyone knows how many zeros in the kilo. Let's say we want to measure the or speak about the DNA length. That's why our uh, main unit is base pairs or bases, okay? That's why I wrote base here as an example. It's not important right now. And kilo, we know that it has three zeros. It means one kilo base has thousand bases in it. Thousand bases. What about those? Let's say you saw mega base, okay? You would just relax. And what you see is the M letter, isn't it? And the first letter. Yes, you will use this and it will remind you the word million. Because the first letter is the same, isn't it? Yeah, that's it. It means megabase has million bases in it. Let's see for gigabase. The same logic with the first letter. It looks like the number 9, isn't it? While writing. It's just a beautiful 9. Yeah, the same. A gigabase has a 9 um, now, billion bases in it. In it. That's it.